Evan, the Illinois primary is just two days away, and tonight local candidates were on the debate floor making their case to voters. We have News 8's Joe McCoy in the studio tonight. Joe, what was the message from the two candidates competing to run against Eric Sorensen for Illinois 17th Congressional District? Yeah, Jonathan, the two candidates really saw eye to eye on most things. There's uh, Joe McGraw, who's a retired judge from Rockford, Rockford and Scott Crawl, who's a Milan farmer. They agree that we need tighter border security and energy independence, among other things. The question is, can one of them knock off Democratic incumbent Eric Sorensen in November in what's expected to be one of the state's most competitive races? Sunday's candidate forum in Kelowna, the final opportunity for Joe McGraw and Scott Crawl to make their pitch to Republican voters in Illinois' 17th Congressional District. That's my number one priority, secure the border, empower law enforcement, make sure respect for rule of law returns. McGraw, who retired from the bench in July, says he's fighting to bring the values of the 17th District to Washington. The top issue on everyone's mind in the district is the crime and the drugs and all of the illegals coming here from across the open border. It's another case of, a, of America last. His challenger, Scott Crawl, a Milan farmer for 33 years, agrees border security is a top priority. He also thinks people's pocketbooks are taking too hard of a hit. Here's the thing that I'm going to work on the hardest, inflation. And inflation is caused by Congress spending too much money. Crawl wants America to become energy independent. He says his fuel and fertilizer costs have doubled in recent years. We need to cut our budget. We need to support our military. We need to support our people in blue, our first responders. On Tuesday, Republicans in the 17th district will make their voices heard on who they think can beat Eric Sorensen in November, an election Sorensen won in 2022 by 4%. The three candidates competing for Illinois State Senate 37th District also spoke at the forum. One of them will fill the seat of State Senator Wynne Stoller, who did not run for re-election. Jonathan.